His 141 appearances ranks first among all-time Aggies, and now as he reaches his last home game, ABC 7's Nate Ryan looks back with an all-time Aggie. Johnny, you've played more games in an Aggie uniform than anybody in program history. So many moments on this court here at the Pan American Center. Is there any one particular shot, though, that stands out in your mind from your time as an Aggie? I'd probably say this one right here. Johnny McCants at midcourt for the win. He got it! Who will ever forget his half-court heave to beat Grand Canyon in 2019? But that win was just one of 118 that Johnny has racked up at New Mexico State, the most by any player in Aggie history. If there's anyone to ask about NMSU's sustained success, it's probably Johnny McCants. Probably one of the top reasons is Coach Shands recruits a bunch of dogs. Um, he recruits a bunch of guys that just want to win. But ironically, that doesn't apply to Johnny. When we was a, a younger player uh, in our program, I used to joke with him like, you know, I inherited you. I didn't recruit you. <laughs> uh, now I certainly wouldn't say that. After graduating from Las Cruces's then Oñate High School in 2016, McCants signed on to play for then Aggie coach Paul Weir. That was six years ago. When the Aggies hired Chris Jans a year later, the new coach issued a challenge. I had too many individual conversations with Johnny to count that I can remember about his work ethic, his approach, and how it could be better. He was trying to get me to understand that I didn't love the game at the moment. I just had passion for it. So he just kind of coached me up to loving it. ...double-A tournaments and won three conference titles. But he's only scored 20 points once, that in his most recent game last Wednesday. Yet if you watch any Aggie game, you know how McCants affects it. I think he's as impactful as anyone we have in our team at the uh, um, influencing the outcome of games. Now the captain has reached his climax. Made me a better man, a better person, a better family member. It's just brought a lot to my life. And last month, it brought a son as Johnny and his girlfriend welcomed the birth of Johnny McCants III. Someone I could provide for. It's just everything. Johnny only has a few weeks left at NMSU, but he's taking it in like a wise veteran. Just want to take these last few games in at home and just play the best I can, play the best Aggie basketball we can, and just continue to have fun. If his career is any indication, at some point, it'll pay off. Nate Ryan, ABC7. Johnny's final home game in Las Cruces is tomorrow night as the Aggies host Utah Valley on senior night at 7 p.m. With a win, Johnny and the Aggies clinched the top overall seed in the WAC tournament. And by the way, if you're not able to go to that game, We'll have it for you on the Las Cruces, El Paso Las Cruces CW.